Hi, my name's Jessie and today we'll be taking a peek into the incredible life of Louis Agassiz. Louis Agassiz was born on May 28, 1807 in Mertier, Switzerland. Swiss born American naturalist, geologist and teacher made revolutionary contribution to the study of natural science with great historic work on extinct fishes. As a child, Lewis became interested in the ways of the brook fish located in Western Switzerland, but his main interest was in ichthyology, a study focused on fishes, which is a branch of zoology, the study of all animals. It began with his study of a large group of Brazilian fishes, mostly from the Amazon River. This study had originally been collected in 1819 and 1820 by two well-known naturalists in Munich. However, when they passed, the collection was given to Louis. The work was completed and published in 1829. The study of fish forms became the leading feature of his research. In the rich stores of extinct fishes of Europe, especially those within Switzerland, the extinct fish within these areas had never been studied in depth before. As early as 1829, Lewis had planned an in-depth study of those fossils and spent most of his time gathering material for this study. The number of named fossils and fishes was raised to more than 1,700 from the ancient seas were made to live again through the descriptions of their inhabitants. The great importance of that fundamental work rests on the monumental force it gave to the study of the extinct life itself. Turning his attention to the other extinct animals found with the fishes, Agassiz published two volumes on the extinct fossil ecoderms, the marine life spines of Switzerland in 1838 to 1842. This study laid the foundation for his worldwide fame. Louis continued his groundbreaking work throughout 1833 through to 1843 all with magnificent illustrations of fossils that were really or had never been seen before. These studies gave Louis even more fame and recognition within the science world. This was adored by many fishermen, farmers, school teachers and regular people all over the world. Not only for his uncontrollable enthusiasm for what he studied, but also for reminding them that science was simply a name for nurturing a deep interest in one's environment. Louis will never be forgotten as his monumental work within the study of zoology and more importantly the study of extinct fish will continue to be used and admired by many scientists and future scientists today. I hope you all thoroughly enjoyed the peek into Louis Agassiz's phenomenal life. Enjoy your day. Bye!